Time now for News Extra, brought to you by Pinnacle Bank, Torrington, and Mitchell, committed to bringing you banking the way banking should be. Here's Kevin Mooney. Thank you very much, Dennis. Good morning, everyone. Bob Hessler is here to talk about a new event that is part of Monument Marathon Weekend, the Twin City Roofing First Annual Barbecue Cook-Off. This will be the night of the marathon on Saturday night. It will follow the marathon over at 18th Street Mini Park uh, parking lot downtown. And, uh, Bob, uh, I guess first of all, we uh, let's explain how this came about because there has been talk for a while about doing something that Saturday night that might be in conjunction with the marathon. And, um, man, you're, you're pulling it off here. Well, Lisa Rogers from uh, Platte Valley Company's Marathon uh, and – uh, Trinity Bergner from the city of Scottsbluff Park and Rec's department were getting together and saying, what could we do to have something go on in downtown Scottsbluff after the marathon? Yeah. And so they got talking and, and Trinity gave me a call and said, Hey, would you be interested in organizing some event for the downtown bash? Cause they're going to block off some of main street right. and have the football game. And she goes, how about a chili cook off? And I said, no, we're going to do a barbecue cook off. Yeah. So she goes, okay. You and you just get it set up and take care of it, and we'll we'll support it. So and don't you love it when uh, people just say, "Well, you take care of it." Yeah, you know? but that's okay. <laughs> Trinity does a lot in the community, and yep. and uh, I got a hold of Greg Wilburn and and Brian Copsey, and they said, "Yeah, we'll help you make this happen." And that's so good. that's where it developed from, and and then we started getting the sponsors, Twin City Roofing and Terry Shank. He stepped right up and said, "Yeah, I'll help you guys sponsor this." And and uh, Adam Reed from the Rock Pile is uh, sponsoring all the meat and brisket, so or the ribs and brisket, I should say. So, you know, the cookers aren't furnishing anything but their time and and heat to cook this stuff up. Yeah, that's fantastic. You got people to supply the meat, and uh, then Kelly Bean is stepping in on the bean part, yep. right? Yes, sir. Kelly Bean is the sponsor of the of the baked bean competition. Uh, and then the other sponsors is the Wilburn Transmission Safety Line. The Scuss with Elks Lodge is, is uh, the backing of this thing and in support for the beer garden and uh, things like that. Yeah. You got Aloe Communications in here, BNC Steel, uh, some other nice sponsors. So there are going to be three different competitions in the cook off, right? There's a meat or the brisket division, the rib division, and then the baked bean division. And with those three categories, the cookers can get in all three if they want. Um, majority of our cookers are doing two or three of the items. Um, it's fifteen dollars for the baked beans, twenty five for the brisket, twenty five for the ribs for an entry fee. Yeah. Uh, and the payout is going to be four hundred dollars for first place for the brisket, four hundred dollars for the ribs, and two hundred dollars for the baked beans. Pretty good. Pretty good deal. And a lot of these brisket guys are going to be up and at it. They're going to be up and at it early, early in the morning on Saturday getting we, their stuff ready, right? We are having a get-together Friday night at 6 o'clock at the Elks Lodge for the cookers and the judges to get together. Yeah. And we're going to go over all the rules, which are pretty basic. Yeah. Um, and then the brisket beat guys that want to get started in the middle of the night, they'll have the brisket handed to them at the mini park area so that they can start prepping their food. But we got some of the guys that are going to start putting it on at 2 and 3 in the morning. Holy cow. So uh, they'll be out there in the in the mini park getting it done, huh? Mm, yes, sir. All right. That's very cool. All right. We'll tell you how the public gets involved in this uh, right after this break. Secure your peace of mind with Pinnacle Bank's new checking account, the Diamond Secure account. With it, you'll get all the great features of our checking accounts, along with identity theft protection and cellular telephone protection. For complete details of this checking account, speak with the bank representative. Open a new Diamond Secure account in branch or at wypinbank.com. To switch your current checking account, visit your local branch in Mitchell or Torrington. Pinnacle Bank, member FDIC. Insurance products are not insured by FDIC or any federal government agency. Not a deposit of or guaranteed by the bank or any bank affiliate. All right, we are back on News Extra. Bob Hessler is here. We're talking about the Twin City Roofing First Annual Barbecue Cook-Off. This will be downtown, the 18th Street Mini Park parking lot. A cash payout for the cooks. Three separate divisions, baked beans, ribs, and brisket. And uh, uh, you have until uh, later on this evening to get in if you want to be a cook, right? Five o'clock tonight is the deadline. Yeah, which is part of the reason why we got you on here. And they'll need to go to Scottsbluff Screen Printing to register. Okay. Shane Wilson's been very supportive of taking care of that for he us. He always is? Yes, he is. Always is very man. supportive. Good guy. Um, and uh, so 
Or they can just give you a call, right? They can give me a call at 631-0076. All right. You already have 10 to 12 cookers. You might have 15 to 16 by the time we hope today's so. all over. We hope so. Okay. Very good. So these guys are all cooking this stuff up, and we're having the downtown bash in the mini park, and then the public has an opportunity to taste all this stuff that that evening, right? Yes, in, in conjunction with the downtown bash, um, Broadway will be shut down, I believe it is, from 17th Street to 19th Street. Yeah. And the public will be able to go to the, the businesses that are open downtown. Uh, and some of the farmer's market people are going to come back down and set up some booths there as well. The gates open at 4 o'clock for the public. Now, this being our first event of the year, um, I always try to organize small and let it grow big instead of growing big and having problems. So I'm going to let everybody be known that we are allowing 200 people in the gate um, that night just because of the size of the liquor license requirements is that we don't have that big of an area. So you got room for 200 people. The first 200 in is it. After that, you won't get in. Um, Food tasting starts at 5 o'clock. The judging will be already in the process going on. Um, Allo Communication is so graciously setting up the cable hookup so that uh, the City of Scotts Bluffs Park and Rec Department, Trinity, is going to bring down their 20-foot by 16-foot big screen, and we're going to watch the Nebraska football game that night at 5.30. Um, the beer garden will go from uh, till 10 o'clock that night. Okay. The beer garden actually opens at 10 because the cookers have to have something to drink while they're cooking. Well, that's just barbecue. That's just part of the deal. But the public is open at 4 o'clock. All right. Okay, so it sounds a lot of, like a lot of fun. If you want to get in, pretty much uh, start lining up a little bit early so you can get in. And, of course, there there may be people that maybe just quite can't get in. They, maybe as other people are leaving, maybe you might be able to get in. We'll have somebody at the gate to, to, to kind of monitor that Somebody stuff. walks out, you go back in. They are We're going to have the porta-potties inside the beer yeah. garden, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, the one thing I do want to mention, though, is is that the gate entry fee – um, half of that is going to go to charity organizations and the people will come in and vote on the people's choice for the ribs, mm-hmm. brisket, and beans. Right. And then their money will be given to a charity of their choice. And then that's where that money is going. All right. $10 to get in. Not very expensive. No. It, and you're going to get to eat. I mean, get the cookers are going to have, have yeah, a lot of food. The cookers are going to have plenty of food. The one thing is, is it's not going to be a plate portion yeah. You're just going to get a walk around all the right. tables and sample and cook or eat, and they've got enough food. We're not. We're making sure that we don't run out. Okay. Boy, this does sound like a lot of fun. Uh, this Saturday night, 18th Street Mini Park uh, parking lot. And, again, uh, you got to be registered by 5 o'clock tonight. So this sounds like a good idea. And uh, maybe there's a couple, three of you that want to be cooking in one as, as one team. Um which I know happens, well, you better talk about it today if you haven't talked about it to this point and uh, get in or if you've been thinking about it, today's the day. We are limiting it to a three-person team, and we do have yeah. some teams that are doing that. Yeah, um, The cookers will, you know, we're encouraging them to set their booth up and have people just yeah. vote on their booth as well, liking what booth is the best and All stuff that like stuff. that. Yeah, just have a good just time. Just to have a great time. We're going to be out here having fun, and, you know, the weather's supposed to be – Ah, a little cool, but it's Nebraska, so it wear is. your it's shirt. Late September, and wear wear your uh, sweatshirt. Wear your Nebraska shirt, not your yep. buff shirt. Mm-hmm. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, that's right. That's that's what the deal is here, right? That's right. It support the. It's a it's a fun time for the marathon and and what Jennifer and the college has done for this event. That's right. That's right. The whole idea is to really have kind of a special weekend, make the Monument Marathon just even more special than mm-hmm. it already is. Yep. All right. Very good. Thanks, Bob. Appreciate Thank you again you for in. allowing me to be on here and talk oh, about bet. this. You bet. No problem. All right. Diabetes, high blood pressure, anxiety meds, everyone's on them. If you're a 50-year-old male, maybe a bit porky, and you may even have type 2 diabetes, a million dollars of term insurance may only cost you about 200 bucks a month. Call 